let us understand why in the first place one has hemifacial spasms. The majority of the patient, the cause is the neurovascular conflict. What does it mean? It means that the facial nerve which comes out of the brain just above the medulla oblongata and below the pons, that is pontomedullary junction, that is brain stem, and then comes out and then supplies one part of the face. It is getting continuously compressed by a blood vessel inside the skull of course, but it is getting compressed by a blood vessel. Why does it happen in these patients? Because their anatomy is as such, the size of the posterior fossa or the space where the nerve lies, specific blood vessel shape is such that starting from the birth, the blood vessel is precariously near the nerve. As the age advances, the blood vessels, they become elongated, they become long. As the age advances, and the vessel is elongating, what will it do? It will slowly burrow itself into the facial nerve. And where is this happening? It is happening inside the skull, that is near the brain stem. As it is progressively burrowing itself in the root entry zone of the facial nerve, it will start imparting its pulsations because blood vessels, that is arteries have pulsations. In brain, even veins have significantly strong pulsations. So, these are the pulsations hitting on the nerve. Okay? Now, these pulsations are causing damage to the nerve over the period of time and they cause demyelination. Or in simple words, let us say they remove coating from individual nerve fibers. So, there is a short circuiting. It is called as demyelination. This demyelination causes these hemifacial spasms.